Hi everybody, welcome back to Daisy and in this video I wanted to talk about improvised storage and specifically my favourite type of improvised storage which is the improvised shelter, the stick improvised shelter. I absolutely love these things and if you're new to Daisy or you've been playing it a while but haven't thought about the improvised shelters for a while, I'm going to gonna tell you about why they are so good. So one of the things in Daisy, you're out and about and you've been um, looting you've got some really good kit and you're thinking right I, I need to store this kit now I need I need to put it somewhere safe so that if I've got killed if I get killed I can go back and get it or maybe you want to go to somewhere a bit more dangerous like Tizzy or Northwest Airfield and you just you just want to stash your stuff um, and kind of early game especially on vanilla servers this can be quite tricky I mean you could obviously if you've got a vehicle you know you can you can put the stuff um, in the car and that will store lots of stuff if you've got a dry bag you can bury that can't you if you've got a protective case you can bury that too um, sea chests you can find them pretty rare though you can bury them wooden crates you can make them but if you haven't got any nails or you haven't got a saw to make some planks you're pretty much stuffed um, barrels really really good but heavy to move around the tents yeah the tents I, I love the tents tents really good if you can find them again it depends which server you're on um, find a tent that's great but look at this look at these improvised shelters there's actually one over there I've put one in front of these trees and it'd be hard push to see it wouldn't you Let, let's run over there and let, let's have a look and I probably haven't angled it the best but there we go there's there's the improvised shelter especially if, if you're on a server that's got build anywhere on um, I remember this is for PC and console and one of the best things about the improvised shelter is that really you can make one without any tools at all um, because in order to make an improvised shelter all you need is rope and four sticks um, and that will make a kit and then once you've put the kit on the ground all, all you need is 50 sticks and four long sticks and those things you can really get on with your hands can't you as you're going around I mean if you've got a knife or an axe or something like that makes it a little bit faster and a little bit softer on your gloves and things like that but it's very very good and remember you can make rope out of rags so as long as you've got a knife to cut the rags you're good to go so you know so your aim is to make a shelter kit and to make a shelter kit you need some rope and four sticks and that you can combine them to make the shelter kit however if you haven't got any rope remember to make rope all you need is two stacks of six rags so 12 rags all together combine them in your hand that will give you rope and then you can get the sticks anyway can't you so let me show you so let's put the rope there let's take the sticks let's um back off a little bit and let's just combine those and then you can see we can scroll up and down with our middle um, mouse wheel and then we've got the craft the shelter kit um, on console I can't remember what it is but if you look at the screen it'll, t it'll tell you the, the tooltip to go through and there we have the shelter kit and then we can pick that up and then basically you then just go and, and place that down somewhere remember we can use our middle mouse wheel to, to move it around and I think it's the shoulder buttons on console to to move stuff around and then we can place it down and then you just need to go and f now th this is the long thing you know you, could, you need to go around and find um, 50, 50 sticks but when you're in the woods and one thing I didn't say actually I should have done is that this thing has a hundred storage so it's perfect really really good really really I really like these so what I've done here as you can see I've already put the kit down and I've gathered together all the sticks so what we can do now is once you've built it built the uh, stick you'll see you'll get this in your proximity inventory and we've got four sticks which we need to put in um, four long sticks for the base and then the materials we can either put in 50 short sticks we can put in four tarpaulins or we can put in eight um, animal um, eight leather things um, I don't think I've ever done that before to make a, a, a more heavy duty um, shelter but for me I think I think the stick one looks best so here we go so let's put the long sticks in like so there we go now let's put the 50 sticks in here I've already stacked them up so this is a little bit easier remember you're probably going to be doing this in the middle of a forest or by yourself where there's plenty of bushes to go around and collect all these sticks 
just watch your gloves when you and uh, anything you're using to make to collect the sticks and to make them and then we just sort of stand in front of it and we get the option to build the improvised shelter dum 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 and there we go there we have the improvised shelter I, I think I mean, it's brilliant isn't it it's so good that is so good and so hidden if you're in the middle of the forest because you know tents are great but they do stick out a bit no matter what even if you get the green ones with this you know from a distance just looks like a bush doesn't it just looks like a bush so there we go so the next time you're out and about and you're on a survey and maybe you know you're in early game run and you get to that point where i really need um i really need some storage now and you know you, you haven't got you know a saw to make um planks to make um a wooden crate um you haven't found yourself a tent you've got no, no other options or even if you have got some other options you know consider the improvised stick um shelter it really is um very very good and uh, one of my favorite things in daisy so what do you think about that am i crazy <laughs> have you tried these out um put your questions and comments down below if you enjoyed the video hit like if you want to see more of the same press subscribe and i will of course see you again soon